Okay, this is a quick haul. I've got a lot of stuff because I've been off work because I've broken my arm. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna take anything out of the bags or anything like that. I'm just gonna show you quickly what I've got and where my arm's better and I'm able to use both arms. I'll do a better video. But this is Darth Vader from Return of the S Revenge of the Sith. Sorry, and it's the lightsaber attack. So if you squeeze the legs together, the lightsaber arm swings together. You can see a picture of Darth Vader there. And you've got the Star Wars logo at the bottom. The grade for this is 9.25 by AFA Modern Grading. And um, so that's quite a high grade. To get this graded, bought, well, I bought the whole thing for a tenner. I've got this from France, so I've got a lot of stuff from France, from France, really. And that this cost ten pounds. The postage and packaging, add that, add that on, would have been enough about five quid. So that's the front of the card. Let me show you. Okay, you've got Darth Vader here on the back of the Revenge of the Sith card, and it's no, he's number 11 in from the collection. Shows you other figures in the rave from 2005 and lightsaber effect. And there's the actual figure. It's quite a good sculpt of Vader. You squeeze the legs, you can just see the arrow, arrow there. You squeeze them together, and the lightsaber arm will move back and forth. And then you've got the different figures there. I haven't got many of these. Okay, so that's Darth Vader, lightsaber attack, Revenge of the Sith. Okay, one more look at Darth Vader, quickly, lightsaber attack. Just saw about the lighting, it's quite bright today. So there you go, Darth Vader. Let's see if I can get a better look at the... Okay, this is the back of the black Bespin guard on the Kenner 45 back. You've got all the 45 figures there, which are Star Wars ones at the top, Empire Strikes Back ones at the bottom. So you've got the black Bespin guard there between the Cloud Car Pilot and the Attack Commander. And then you've got the special offer, Star Wars Action Figure Display Arena. And these are the display arenas you could get if you sent in those pops there. This offer was never in the UK. So that's your Empire Strikes Back card, 45. Okay, now have a look at the Empire Strikes Back Bespin Guard, the black version, and you can see the figure. Got quite a lot of Empire Strikes Back figures today. Loose though, not not carded. And you can see the no gold braiding, the Kenner logo there, and the grades. This is really cheap. Got this from France as well. So this comes from France. It's an easy figure to find on the Empire Strikes Back card. Um, ungraded, you could get maybe get one for 40 quid. So most rare version of this figure would probably be on the Trilogo hybrid card. Which I do have, but it's a bit tatty, but I do have that. Let's just make out the 
figure. Okay, so quite a boring figure, but still a classic. And I had that one when I was a kid as well, so quite good fun. I had both best wing guards. Okay, first figure to see is Anakin Skywalker from Power of the Force 1985. And I've shown this figure a couple of times, or uh, so. He's one of the last 17. And he's AFA graded. He's uh, AFA 85. He's not uncirculated. So it's a, a, just 85 near mint. And it says loose action figure Anakin Skywalker, 1985. And classic outfit. Sebastian Shaw was the actor that played him. And I'll show you the... Okay, there's the back of the figure. Anakin Skywalker. In his little plastic box. Okay, next thing I want to show you is the Snow Trooper from 1980. It's the uh, Empire Strikes Back. It's a bit hard to see with a white background, but it still looks pretty cool. You can uh, try and look at all the details of the body. Very white. This one's UK graded. Comes with a really long rifle. And says Imperial Stormtrooper, made in China, rarity is one star, so it's not rare, figure is 85%, paint is 80%, cape is 85%, so he has a white cape on it as well, which is hard to pick up with this camera. Okay, so that's your Snow Trooper, cool figure. Okay, there's the back of the figure, so you can see the helmet and the backpack which is carved into the back of the figure and the white cape it comes with plastic vinyl cape and the rifle it comes with so there's your classic Empire Strikes Back 1980 Snow Trooper okay so here's one more look at the Snow Trooper and by modern standards, it's a bit... Well, it's of its time, isn't it? So, you can't really say much about it. It's a classic. Nice snow trooper. UK graded. And now, let's look at... Okay, now we've got Luke Jedi Knight with the green lightsaber and I've shown a UAT Luke, Luke with a blue lightsaber this is a UK graded version it says Star Wars Luke Skywalker the only re a remarkable thing about this figure is it's made in Taiwan there's the green lightsaber and the pistol and there's the costume and the cape, this looks like the sewn cape. You can get a variation with the snap cape, which comes with a little metal clip, which means you can open it. This is the sewn version. This is overall grade is 85. And you can just make out Luke underneath the robe. Here's the back of the figure can't really see much because of the cloth, cloth cape. There's the gun, let's see if we can get the weapon. Get the pistol and the lightsaber there, just about. And the two feet sticking out underneath the cape. UK graded. And next we've got IG-88. And this is a really good figure for its time. The detailing on the body is really good. Okay, it's not articulated like figures are now, but it's really good detailing. I never had this one when I was a kid. 
So, this is IG-88, comes with two weapons, an Imperial Blaster and a specific long rifle. And here you are, nice details on this figure. Let's see what else we've got there. So there's IG-88, one more look. Nice detail. Okay, the last figure to show from this lot is Han Solo in Hoff outfit. And there's nothing remark remarkable about this figure, it's a nice figure. Comes with all this brown pa pants or tan pants, blue jacket, and a great face sculpt, if you ask me. Graded 85 overall, Han Solo Hoff outfit. Here's the back of the figure. You can see the hood, the back of the neck scarf, the holster that you can put the gun in, and the back of his legs. UK graded, so four of these are UK graded and one of them is AFA graded. Okay, one more look at this lot of five figures from France that I got at good prices. The only expense was the transporting it from France to here. That's a bit steep, but we've got Anakin Skywalker UK graded 85, Luke Skywalker Jedi Knight Green Saber uh, AFA 85, IG 88 UK graded 85. Uh, there's two versions of IG 88. This, I think this is the silver version. There's a grey version as well. And then you've got Han Solo Hoff Outfit UK graded. And then you've got the Snow Trooper. He's AF, no, UK graded as well, made in China. And the Luke's made in Taiwan. All the other three are made in Hong Kong. And Anakin Skywalker is AFA graded, US graded. 85. So five cool action figures. All 85. Nice stuff there got at a really good price. I mean you know, on eBay you could pay what I paid for all five of these you could pay just for one of these. So that's why I snapped these up. Okay, so IG, Han, Snowtrooper, Anakin and Luke Skywalker. Time to say goodbye. Okay these are the 3D cards that came out in 2010. For the Empire Strikes Back, there's the card wrapper, and then the, these are the cards. Hard to show the 3D motion. I can't really do do that much because my arm's broken. So there's the first card, or one of the first cards. There's another card. Really nice cards. These never knew these came out of this set. Got quite a lot of trading cards, especially the old ones, plus some quite a lot of the new ones been neglecting that area of collecting of late because I've been concentrating on action figures. There's Luke trying to reach for the lightsaber. There's Luke on the communicator on the and then there's Luke and Leia or Han and Leia. Can you see this 3D almost? So these are the first five cards. Got the whole set for less than a fiver. So maybe six quid, seven quid including um, posting and packaging. 3D cards tend to be really expensive as well, so that's the first lot. Here's the second set, or second page, because the guy sent me them in the pages. So you've got Han and the Rebel Officer, wondering where Luke is. And we've got C3PO and there's General or Major Derlin, or whatever his name, Cliff from uh, Cheers. So this guy's John Ratzenberger, he played Cliff in Cheers. 
and they're about to close the shield door. Don't know if you can really see the 3D. There's Darth Vader in his ch meditation chamber. And then we've got Luke reaching again for his lightsaber. Oh, that's, that's the one uh, that was behind that. Okay, so I showed that one. And we've got Luke in the back to chamber. Getting healed, getting some healing. And then we've got Luke Skywalker, I mean uh, Princess Leia, briefing the Rebel Snowspeeder pilots. That's a really good image there. We've got that page there. Let's see if we can get better 3D images there. Or well, maybe not. Too much light now. Nice cards though. Okay, so we've got Luke flying the snow speeder there. We've got the Atat. We've got the Atat drivers there. We've got Han Solo not wanting to be interrupted. Darth Vader, I mean Star Destroyers, and there's Darth Vader there. Hard to show the 3D, let's see if we can get some. Nope, oh dear. Okay, we've got the space slug. About to take a bite of the Manelian Falcon. We've got Bosk the Bounty Hunter. We've got Yoda. We've got Luke Skywalker. Face revealed when he cuts off Darth Vader's helmet in the Dagobah tree. And then we've got Luke Skywalker trying to raise the um, X Wing and obviously failing. Then we've got a very dark picture there Boba Fett uh, in his Slave One about to follow after Han Solo in the Falcon we've got the best bin freezing chamber we've got Han Solo being frozen in carbonite we've got Luke Skywalker arriving to face Darth Vader we've got Darth Vader and Boba Fett there that's not come out at all that one We've got uh, Luke Skywalker and R2-D2. And we've got the Clash of the Lightsabers. 3D card there. So that's six there. That's the fifth of... These are the backs of the cards. These are the backs of the cards. This is the... The set is uh, 46 cards in the set. Well, that is number 46 there. So 46 cards. Maybe I left a, that's the back of these two cards. There's Boba Fett and Vader. There's these cards, I showed this already, I made a mistake. There's Darth Vader, Luke Skywalker, Landa, Christian, Princess Leia, Han Solo, and Yoda. I've seen all these cards have the, these sort of pictures on them, and then it has the little movie scene. 
No. Next lot. Got the lightsaber. X-wing. Falcon. Other things there. Chewbacca. Han and Leia. Darth Vader and the hologram. Yoda. Luke. View from the slow speeder cockpit. Han and Leia again. Star Destroyers. Snow Troopers. Han and Leia in the off base. Luke. Oh, there's that Dak. Must be Dak. Wampa. Luke after he's been rescued by Han and Chewie. Or Han. No Rebel Snow Troopers, soldiers. The ex executor or executor. The Luke about to be rescued by Han in the distance. Okay. One more page to show you.